Hi, it's Jenny Think here with Good For You Gluten Free, and I am live from Chili's, and I hope you can hear me. I have, you can see I have a microphone on today, and so if for any reason you can't hear me, let me know, because then I'll take the microphone off, but I'm hoping you can hear me more clearly. So like I said, I'm at Chili's, and I am testing some of the menu items for gluten using my NEMA sensor, which is right here, and I've got a test in progress. This post is sponsored by NEMA Sensor. I've been working with them, I think, almost two years, and I've been going around all sorts of restaurants, mostly chain restaurants that most of you around the country have heard of, like Chili's, and I like to test things that are on the gluten-free or gluten-friendly menu to see if they have gluten in it. So I've done a test already. I'm currently doing a test, and then I'm gonna show you how to do a test. So we're gonna try to do a bunch of stuff in a short amount of time. So what I have testing right now in here, you can see it's thinking. This is testing for gluten. Um, I am testing the chicken fajitas, and I put a little piece of the chicken, a little piece of the rice, and a little piece of, um, like a drip of the beans in there. So we'll just double check to make sure everything is gluten-free. But I did check the gluten-friendly menu. I'm gonna pull it up, and it said that the fajitas are gluten-free and free from cross contact with gluten um, if you get it with corn tortillas, of course, not the flour tortillas. And so we're gonna just make sure that it is gluten-free because this is what I ordered that I'm gonna share with my son. And um, so that is on the menu. And something else that was on the gluten-friendly menu was this text, wait, what is it called? Text, <laughs> my son wrote it down for me. Chipotle chicken fresh mex bowl without the tortilla chips because he told me the tortilla chips are cooked in the shared fryer so you don't want to do anything fried here at Chili's and I did put like some of the sauce and the cheese and a little bit of this bean in my NEMA sensor and I it came back with gluten found so I was kind of bummed to receive that message and like really really bummed to receive that message um, it's actually something my husband ordered and um, so I'm waiting for it to pop up I was just logging on here it looks like it my NEMA I have the NEMA app and just logged me off I was just logged in but it logged me off um, but it's gonna document that gluten was found in this Fresh Mex Chipotle. Wait, what is it? Chipotle chicken fresh Mex bowl. Sorry, my son keeps reminding me what it's called. Um, I don't know if it's the sauce or the sour cream or what it is, but um, Nima did find gluten. I might go through and do a double test on it later just to make sure, but um, for right now, I'm not eating that. So um, I did order it gluten free just to test it. So thank you, Nima. Not going to eat it because of you. Thank you so much. Um, obviously this is not a gluten-free restaurant they're just they're pretty good about allergies here um, but it's not a gluten-free restaurant and that's always a, a, um, a problem you know like there's always a risk of cross contact or you know gluten getting in something that you didn't think it would be in I guess a sauce or something okay so let's see how this is doing okay so the fajitas are still testing and then after this test is revealed if you stick with me oh it's already here okay perfect so the fajitas the beans and the rice are gluten-free I got a smiley face that makes me so happy and I want you to stick with me because I am now gonna test the corn tortillas so I'm gonna show you how you can test it by the way I'm super happy that the fajitas are safe so I can eat those. So I'm gonna just take this out. Um, I have a new test capsule. You have to use a new test capsule every time. And um, what you wanna do, I usually try to do without touching it with a clean utensil so that in case my hands have touched gluten, I'm just gonna put a little bit, can you see that, Darren? My husband's filming it, so. Um, I'm just gonna put a little piece of the corn tortilla. And I mean, these are just made with corn, but gosh, you never know, right? And these are listed as gluten-free or gluten-friendly on the gluten-friendly menu. So I just put a little bit in. Did you guys see that? I did it so fast, sorry. And then you just gotta turn it all the way so that it, you know, lines up. And then when you shake it, you can actually hear the, like, water, whatever's in there, not water, but you can hear it kind of swishing around. So you won't hear that until you actually break the seal. So then I put it in and I'm gonna do another test. 
and then it says testing for gluten. And this is a new thing where it says testing for gluten. It, um, used to not see that, it just went right into the test. But now NEMA sensor has a peanut sensor as well. So if you get a peanut sensor, it'll say testing for peanuts. So this is a way you can distinguish if you have the peanut sensor or the gluten sensor. And they also have different test capsules for the peanut sensor. Okay, so I just wanted to show you the app. Oh, I got a notification. Can you see that? It says, looks like NEMA found gluten Oh, okay, here you go. These are, this is my notification screen on my phone. It says, looks like Nima found gluten. And then it, you know, tells me to log it. So I would just go into the app. I just need to unlock my phone. And I go into my test. And here's the test I just did at 1.48 p.m. today. Can you see that okay? Yeah. So then I would just go and log that. And I'll do that. And it just says, what restaurant would you order? Was it supposed to be gluten-free or not? And so I'll log that. So anyone who's eating in this area, I live in Denver, will be able to see that this meal tested that it had gluten in it or not. Um, both, you know, I had one that found gluten and one that didn't find gluten. And if you go to the map, like I can just zoom. I'm so sorry if you guys can see this. I can actually click on any of these green places and these places have been NEMA tested. This is where I live. So you can see this is Denver. So these are places that have been tested, a lot of them probably by me, but I've noticed I actually clicked on a few today and there were some restaurants that I didn't know. Um, like I saw a noodle place or something that tested um, gluten-free with the NEMA sensor, so I might go and eat there. So it's a great way to find restaurants that have been tested in your area and you can use the app for free without even having a NEMA sensor. But if you want a NEMA sensor, you can go to nemasensor.com and add the uh, NEMA sensor starter kit to your cart. And if you use my coupon code, which is good for you, GF, and it's written in the post, in the Facebook post, but good for you, GF is my code, my coupon code, you'll get $50 off. So you can go get one of your own. It really helps you, as you can see, like it's telling me not to eat this, this is okay to eat. And it just gives me a little bit more peace of mind over, um, you know, eating out. Cause I, I like to eat out. I'm being really honest. I get, it's like some people send me hate mail. I can't believe you eat out all this stuff. Like you're, you have celiac, but honestly, I love to eat out and I want to be able to eat out and I want to be able to feel normal and I want to go out with my family and my friends, but I want to do it in a safe, a safe way as possible. And I take all the precautions and I disclose my allergens. I speak with the manager often. Um, and you know, I have the NEMA sensor just to give me that extra layer of protection so I can eat out and I can be social and I can have fun. So this looks like it's still in progress and it might take another minute. So what I'm gonna do is post the results of the corn tortillas in the comments so you'll find the results out in a couple minutes, okay? All right, so if you have any questions, leave me a comment. I'm happy to answer. Again, the Tex-Mex bowl, gluten found. The fajitas, no gluten found. Um, I am going to go talk to the manager now, too, and let him know. All right. Thank you. Bye.